So last night I got into a bit of a tiff with Jackie Lambie. You tell me that! But the thing is, Jackie Lambie isn't alone in not knowing what shitty art actually is. So let me break it down. Firstly, Let's get rid of the word law. Sharia is not a system of laws, like Australia's legal system is a series of laws that everybody must obey. Sharia is about a Muslim's personal relationship with their God. The Quran clearly states that there is no compulsion in religion, so a proper implementation of Sharia doesn't ever force anyone to follow its rules. There is no parallel legal system. I can't use Sharia as an excuse to get out of a speeding ticket, no matter how hard I try. In fact, I'm religiously obligated to follow Australian law. Sharia does have some basic principles though. It's about justice and equality, and it's dynamic and fluid and open to interpretation. But there are sometimes misunderstandings. So let's address some of the really obvious issues. Last night, I said that Islam was a feminist religion. And some people found that hard to understand. But what is really important to understand is the difference between religion and culture. Saudi Arabia doesn't allow women to drive. No other Muslim country has that law. It's cultural and reflects the conservative and patriarchal nature of that society, not what Sharia stands for. Another example, I wear a hijab or a headscarf, but it may not look like the traditional headscarf that you may expect. And that's kind of the point. Some women wear a traditional scarf, some women wear a burqa, some women wear an aqab, and some people wear nothing at all. Well, on their heads, like, you know, the rest of them is chill. It's their choice. It's our choice. Some countries do force women, but that's not Sharia. Now, I'm not going to deny that some countries run by Muslims are violent and sexist and do oppress their citizens. But again, that's not down to Sharia. That's down to the culture and the patriarchy and the politics of those particular countries. In the Quran, it clearly states that if one kills an innocent person, it's as if they've killed the whole of humanity. Murder is completely forbidden. I follow Sharia, and my interpretation of that means that I must also fight for people's human rights. Look, these are only a few points, and like any belief system, religious or otherwise, it's supremely complex, and Muslims disagree on a lot of the issues. But at the end of the day, it's about justice and equality. So really, Jackie has nothing to worry about, except maybe me next time on Q&A.